Right now we're photographing a mosquito in ultraviolet. Some patterns in the mosquitoes will show up uh, in ultraviolet light more than they do in visible light. So I don't know if anybody's used it photographically before. It's intended for forensic investigations. And so even like fabrics and stuff, you'll see all of the lint and all sorts of various things on my clothing because they fluoresce in different ways. Certain species, their bodies will glow. In other species, some of their markings and their patterns will glow. Kind of mysterious when you see them in this different light. It's just a freshly pinned specimen, but a piece of uh, dust or fibers has landed on top of it and it's fluorescing on top of the specimen. We can see a very glowy fiber on the top of this guy. You are looking at a mosquito coming into focus. The blues that you're seeing are directly caused by the ultraviolet light. And we take a look back here, it's fluorescing green. So different parts of the mosquito are fluorescing under different colors, uh, creating a really interesting color palette to the image. The camera moves forward and backward by a very, very small margin, almost invisible for us to see. If you were looking at the camera, you wouldn't think it's moving at all. After 130 frames, it moves the width of the mosquito. So that's a few millimeters or so. You have to breathe very softly, walk by the camera very carefully because a fraction of a millimeter shift from the camera or the subject is gonna throw everything off. The footage, if you were to play it back at regular speed, might play back over a few seconds. It took most of an hour to complete. So it's very time intensive in order to get anything useful out of this technique. So I sit here toiling away to get something interesting. I spent days working with dead mosquitoes and it's kind of interesting. I never thought it would be fun, but uh, these creatures always have something more to reveal. Mosquito. Światowa premiera w czwartek o 22 na Discovery Channel.